What's Cherry guys, today I'm going to show you how to properly style a hoodie because it's getting cold outside and homeboy down there is already small enough. So I'm going to break it down into three things and they're going to be sizing, colors, and variety. So yeah, here we go. By the way, stay tuned to the end. I have a giveaway and the instructions will be stated in the description. First on the table, we got sizing. So for this one, it seems super simple, which it is, but it could go either way. Super fitted hoodies should stay for working out unless you want to look like a condom. I'd say in 2018, it's even better to lean more into the oversized bit of the spectrum as that look is way better as opposed to Mr. Trojan Ultra Thin over here. Like all things in life, too much of anything is a bad thing. Except for respecting women, right? No such thing as too much respect for women. Examples being like water. Did you know that 100% of people that drink water die? Bro, that also too much air. Did you know that 100% of people that breathe air die? Bro, that too. I'm holding my breath and peeing substantially less now. Oh yeah, there's also no such thing as too thick too. Right, Pokey? Nothing's too thick, Frugal. But yeah, don't go heavy on the oversizing either, or you'll just look like you need a hug. Just look in the mirror and feel it out as everyone's perception of oversized is different, but getting something bigger is always comfy and stylish. Pretty simple tip, but it can go a long way for you. Next up on the table, we got color. Now, a lot of people tend to gravitate towards the black hoodie, which is totally fine. I love my black friends. Hello? Yo, Kurt, you know I love you, right? Shut up, Christian. Are, are you eating Popeyes? No. But like I said, black hoodies are always a solid color choice, but there are many different colors you can get away with, especially if it's just a plain hoodie. You might be turned off to the thought of a loud color on something as big as a hoodie, but just keep it plain for the most part, you shouldn't be that bad. Some good colors for the fall are like darker earth tones too, like your grays and your navy. But if you're trying to stand out, I think orange is a pretty good color for this year, really being thrown on a lot of pieces as you can see, and I think it's working considering how much these pieces go for oh my god it's because of the orange definitely worth a try and if you don't like it you know then just do this you don't have to be spending a lot of money on hoodies either i've been telling you guys forever gildan hoodies super cheap and cheap doesn't even necessarily mean bad i mean we all get dollar menu stuff from mcdonald's and we all eat instant ramen why can't clothes be cheap as well why are we discriminating it's like 16 dollars. you can buy like 16 mcchickens with that here's our food 16 mcchickens yeah can i just have my food why don't you just buy a hoodie yeah, I, I, what does that have anything to do? Can no, I just, just buy a hoodie. Oh my god. Buy a hoodie. But you'd probably find more use in the hoodie unless you're just really hungry. Look, now I have 16 McChickens and I don't know what to do with them and I'm still cold as hell, but just buy the damn hoodie. You're not losing anything. No one cares that you're rocking Gildan. Or you could go with the pink for that extra respect women breast cancer awareness month donate them dollars boy back to the point you got an assortment of colors for mad cheap so don't let your fashion ego get to your head just because it's not name brand go through that 64 pack of crayons and pick your favorite one because there's probably a hoodie out there for that color go follow my instagram at christian vy for that extra respect women lastly we got variety and by this i mean there are more than just regular hoodies but even switching it up with a zip up could change the whole game leaving it open to layer with a shirt is always a nice switch up from just throwing the hoodie on even those shirt line ones are cool if you're not thick enough and you get cold easy but definitely get thick if you can though i'll hook you up but overall if you mix all these tips together you can definitely pick and choose which tips work for you and which ones don't or you can just buy a supreme hoodie and everything's okay now real quick before we end though me and StockX are teaming up to help you guys out because everyone's out here trying to flex but not everybody has the fun so we're leaving no broke boy left behind with this giveaway for a pair of the new nike acronym prestos super colorful all you gotta do is follow StockX on instagram download the StockX app subscribe to their youtube and comment your size down below everything's in the description it's that easy if that's too hard for you then you don't deserve to be flexing in these anyways but yeah i'm picking a winner in next week's video so go you have seven days all right guys thanks for watching the video and hopefully you're able to get yourself out the hood and in a hoodie follow my instagram at christian vy for more respect women and follow my twitter at christian vyyt for some more memes email me at frugal aesthetic at gmail.com for anything and yeah guys stay cherry respect women but most importantly